All right. Welcome, everyone, to He Is My Master. It's the top Sonic fanfic on fanfiction.net. I closed out of Pokemon, I did. But we're going to be <laughs> reading the screenplay version here on AO3. Okay. So without further ado, Andre, you're the narrator. Take us in. <laughs> All right. Chapter 1, Scene 1, Teaser. Over Black. In another world, far, far away from canon. Exterior of Doom's Castle at night. Interior of Doom's Castle continued. <laughs> the halls are empty and quiet, except the repeated noise of a whip lashing, each followed by a cry of pain. The sounds become clearer as we near the source. Interior of the dungeon continued. Hey, Sonic, give us a few cries of pain. Ha! <laughs> um, what the fuck would a cry of pain sound like? <gasps> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> don't, don't do it like that. <laughs> Subsonic is locked in a wooden pillory and bent forward. Excuse me, sub Sonic? Yes, very sub. Yes. <laughs> I'm start over. Here. He's not Dom Sonic yet. He's oh my Sub-Sonic. god! <laughs> I, I'm too innocent for this. When when I read Sub Sonic, I think of like the speed, not the. <laughs> You are too innocent. Subsonic is locked in a wooden pillory and bent forward. Prince Shadow is standing behind him, hitting his back with a writing crop. His strokes calm and clean, with pauses in between. Lazar is standing further behind them both, watching with smug satisfaction. Amboss the bull and Greytail the cat <laughs> are watching from no, by Lazar, the door. Stop it looking bored like they've been there a while. Sonic screams as he's hit again. He's squirming to escape. Be sure to make it sound like he's in pain. Yeah. Master! I don't- I don't fucking know, like, how- Like, huh? like master! Uh, please! Like, kinda like that. Master! Yeah, it sound- Please! Shadow scowls and hits him again. Please! No more! Sonic is openly crying now. Amboss and Greytail perk up, looking should, I, should I redo that one? No, but do some crying. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. This is fun. This is a fun recording session. Sonic is openly crying now. Amboss and Greytail perk up. <laughs> <laughs> looking ho- God damn it! God fucking damn it! Sonic is openly crying now. Amboss and Greytail perk up, looking hopeful. Sonic whips. Fuck! Right. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're reading it so seriously, too. <laughs> Sonic takes the whip from Shadow's hand and, and fucking and like whips the fuck out of Shadow. What the <laughs> <laughs> Sonic is openly crying now. Amboss and Greytail perk up, looking hopeful. Shadow whips Sonic one last time, hard. After a pause, Lazar steps towards Shadow. This should be enough for today, Do my prince. Shadow's eyes, still on Sonic, are a bit watery with anger and pity. Great! Right. <laughs> I read the notes and I, I read it as it turns out ow. <laughs> ow. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Ow. Whenever what I what is ow? Well, well ow. most people write it down as AO3. Archive of our own. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Ow. <laughs> it turns out ow. <sighs> well said, Andre. Thank you. Chapter 2. Scene 2. Emerald Race. I just now realized I don't know which shadow I'm going to do for this. <laughs> Over Black. Meanwhile, in the realm of Canon, exterior Shadow's house during the day. Yes, Sonic the Hedgehog jogs to the front door and rings the doorbell. Interior of Shadow's house continued. Shadow the Hedgehog is looking under a cushion where he's when he's interrupted. Fuck, I'm going to try that again. <laughs> 
Sorry, <laughs> sorry. All right. I mean, you Shadow don't have to get it perfect. He's looking under a cushion when he's. Uh! <laughs> what? <laughs> Take three. All right. <laughs> Shadow the Hedgehog is looking under a cushion when he's interrupted by the sound of the doorbell. He looks towards the door, and his eyes narrow. Interior, exterior, Shadow's house, continued. Shadow opens the door. Where is it? Oh. Where the fuck is it, Sonic? Answer me, dammit! (laughs) There might... Sonic! Answer me, dammit! (laughs) <laughs> Why are you muted? Because my fucking my mom was like, "Yo, where are you?" Oh, okay, that's fair. Oh. Mm. Where is it? You looking for something? Where is my emerald? Oh, well, after you decided not to race me earlier, I took your emerald and left it on that rock in the middle of that barren plain in Windy Valley. Shadow dashes off as Sonic finishes. Sonic grins to him. Grin. Fucking idiot. Can't pronounce fucking grins. Fuck you, Andre. You piece of shit. Okay, sorry. Uh, <laughs> Shadow dashes off as Sonic finishes. Sonic grins to himself and then like dashes after him. Like how it specifically says a Crush 40 style theme song. <laughs> wow. Would you like me to put the name of the song there instead? A, you linked it? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. All right. Exterior of the Windy Valley continued. A Crush 40 style theme song starts playing, and Sonic and Shadow race across the dry, grassy landscape. Sonic takes a shortcut, and when their paths meet again, Sonic is slightly ahead of Shadow. Hey, Shadow! What's up with your speed? Guarantee on your skates run out? Shadow gives a vicious, annoyed snarl as he strains to move faster. He soon catches up. (laughs) Thought you'd never catch up. Enjoying the race so far? Shut it, Baker. I want my emerald back. I know, that's why I borrowed it after all. Sonic laughs and jumps across a log, Shadow following a moment later. I know. And that's also why I'll kill you as soon as I have my hands on it. Eventually, Shadow's glare becomes a more neutral expression. He continues to watch Sonic and is distracted enough that he nearly trips over a root. God damn it! (laughs) What's the matter, Shads? Need a hand? You'll need a blood transfusion soon. (laughs) Shadow trips and says, God damn it! (laughs) God damn it. <laughs> Shadow manages another burst of speed and shoves Sonic with one hand as he passes him. Sonic yelps but doesn't slow down. Hey! No fair! Life isn't fair. Get used to it. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking script. Alright, sorry. Uh, <laughs> Sonic grins excitedly. Shadow turns away when he sees this. (laughs) What is wrong with him? Shadow looks at his hand that shoved Sonic, rubbing his fingers together a bit and blushing slightly. (laughs) What's wrong with me? Final stretch of the road! Here goes nothing! Sonic speeds up as they reach the barren plain. The white emerald is laying on a rock at the the center. Try that again. Take two. Sonic speeds up as they reach the barren plain. The white emerald is laying on a rock in the center of it. What? Shadow does a poorly aimed spin dash at Sonic, who dodges with a laugh. They are now neck and neck, and both reaching their physical limit. As they near the emerald, they each stretch out a hand to it and shout, Chaos Control! Chaos Control! (laughs) Too slow, Faker. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> Too slow. <laughs> Chaos control! There, there's the line. There you go. <laughs> I had to take... My mom was just like, here, and gave me my meds. <laughs> <laughs> Chaos? Oh, thanks for the meds. <laughs> Chaos, I did, thanks. I did, I did tell her thanks for the meds. <laughs> Chapter 3. Scene 3. Dungeon. A fancy transition. 
<laughs> Interior of dungeon at night. Return to scene one, except the previous Sonic and Shadow are now replaced with their canon versions pathway through Shadow's pathway. final swing at Sonic. <laughs> pathway? <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with you? That says partway. Fucking path. <laughs> I can't, dude. All right. Fuck, God damn it. <sighs> Return to scene one, except the previous Sonic and Shadow are replaced with their canon versions partway through Shadow's final swing at Sonic. Shadow's hand comes down, hitting Sonic with the writing crop. Oh. <laughs> Ow! What the? Shadow blinks in confusion and looks from the hand holding the crop to Sonic's rear. He's still out of breath from the race. What? This should be enough for today, my prince. You do not look very well, if I may say so. All right, Mr. Uh, who the fuck, the guy from fucking uh, uh, Half-Life. Anyway. Um. <laughs> Gordon Freeman. I don't know Freeman. who that is. <laughs> okay. Morgan Freeman. G-Man. G-Man. G-Man, that's Morgan right. Yeah, look, up, look up G-Man after we record this. <laughs> Shadow stares at him for a few moments before nodding slowly. Hey, you! Get me out of here! Excuse me, my prince. Whippy, whippy, whippy. <laughs> you do not whippy, whippy, speak whippy. unless spoken to, slave. Or else my good friend Whippy will whip you. At, at the surprise hey, of this... you're trying to whip a slave. Would you like any help? <laughs> <laughs> Instead of Clippy, it's Whippy. At the surprise of this, what you could call a cool whip, Sonic <laughs> yelps in clippy, surprise it's a when he's struck, <laughs> and then goes wide-eyed and. You mean like the Windows ninety eight companion? Yeah. Exactly. Yes, he means like the Windows ninety eight companion. I noticed you're trying to whip someone. Would you like help? Man. <laughs> All right. Graytail sighs and approaches them. Shadow Watcher and Greytail takes a red collar from Lazar's hands and snaps it tightly shut around Sonic's neck and then attaches a leash to it. Amboss then comes and unlocks the pillory. Sonic pushes himself, pushes, pushes. Sonic pushes himself up tiredly and grabs his leash. Lazar lashes his hand at Sonic and snarls back at him. Lazar looks at him smugly until he notices Sonic's gloves. Gloves? You have already fitted him with clothing, my prince? Shadow stops staring at Sonic after a moment and regains his default scowl. Yes. Yes, I did. Very well. I think we should take your slave to your father for now. Perhaps we have made a little progress today, though I personally doubt it. Lazar and Greytail head towards the door, dragging Sonic <laughs> along, who stumbles slightly. Shadow stares blankly. Lazar turns around when he reaches the door. Wouldn't you like to accompany us, my prince? Shadow follows them. Sonic watches him suspiciously as he approaches, and Shadow meets his gaze. Lazar and Greytail begin walking again as he catches up. I'm here. Sonic relaxes I'm noticeably. I'm here. I'm so, here. God damn it. I'm here. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. All right. Sonic relaxes <laughs> noticeably, and they all leave the dungeon. As they walk up some stairs, Sonic briefly grabs at his collar and twists his head in discomfort. Shadow, I don't think we're in Kansas anymore. Amboss closes the dungeon door. Doom. All right, who the fuck's gonna be Black Doom? Oh, Black Doom. Black Doom. That's what they called my penis. No, I'm just kidding. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> A. <laughs> okay. Fuck yeah. Uh, too bad the Black Plague Cup podcast never made that joke. Chapter 4, Scene 4 How I Met Your Father Interior of the Castle Halls Continue. How I Met Your Mother reference 
<laughs> you know Lazar and like Rato it. lead Shadow and Sonic through several stone castle halls, up some stairs, around some corners, and eventually through a door. Interior of the throne room. Black Doom is on the throne, taking a fat dookie. Sonic stares. Shadow masks his surprise quickly. Lazar and Greytail stand at attention. <laughs> on the throne. <laughs> well. Lazar hits the inside of Sonic's knees with the riding crop. On your knees before his majesty, slave. Sonic glares at Lazar before slowly assuming a sprinter's starting position on one knee. Prince Shadow has taken the slave for another lesson in obedience, your majesty. I see is no collar. Any explanation for that, Lazar? Yes, my liege. We thought more contact with the prince might be beneficial for the training and the breaking of this slave. We collared him so your son might take him with him tonight. I see. Then he needs a name too. Shadow, what is he going to be called? Everyone looks at Shadow. I'm supposed to name him. Shadow looks at Sonic for a few moments, trying to discern his body language, which looks vaguely pleading. Sonic, I'll call him Sonic. Sonic relaxes slightly. <laughs> Very well. Something like Toy might have been more appropriate. Appropriate fuck. A puppet. Leave it in a improv. A puppet. Something like toy might have been more appropriate, but if it means you break him properly, it is none of my concern. It is your pet slave. I'm her what? N what? Her? Her? <laughs> What? I mean, it's 2022. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's 2022. <laughs> I'm his what? <laughs> Ow! Shadow reacts by looking at Sonic with a blush. Uh, I blush. But I decree. <laughs> it will. Shadow, dominate Blushing me. Noises. It will. Daddy, it will. <laughs> it will. Shadow, dominate me. It will. Wow! <laughs> What are you fucking birds now? Shut the fuck up. Wait, what is this? <laughs> but I decree that he is to receive further corporal punishment still today. In my presence, he has been insolent twice. And if you weren't your property, Shadow, I would have put him to death today. You may go now. Interior, castle halls, moments later. Shadow, Sonic, and Greytail are standing outside the throne room, watching Lazar leave down the hallway. Good. I want you to take him to my quarters and tie him up there. I will take care of him shortly. Yes, my prince. Shadow watches as Greytail leads an incredulous-looking Sonic away. Sonic tries to look back at Shadow, but gets strangled by the pull of his collar. Greytail leads him around a corner and through some more halls. They arrive at an ornately de decorated door. Ornately decorated. Decor all right, all right. Uh, this this is this one's more dialogue heavy, and it's just it's pretty much just you and I. Oh wow, and a couple a couple yeah. Lazar lines. Yep. Bob Nobody Lazar. cares about yeah. Lazar. <laughs> Jesus. Oh god, that's a lot. <laughs> Nobody cares about you. Go die. How dare you? What? What? <laughs> All right. How Chapter 5. Where are you? <laughs> <laughs> what was that? What? <laughs> that fucking Scooby Doo sounded laugh. <laughs> <laughs> you good? <laughs> All right. Chapter 5, Scene 5, Night 1, Interior, Prince's Room, Continued. 
Greytail leads Sonic through the door into the prince's room. It has a large bed, a writing desk with books on it, a wash basin, a chest of drawers, a round table, and a circular rug in the center of the room. It all looks quite luxurious. Sonic looks around with an excited expression that says, Well, this isn't so bad. Cut to... Sonic looks very disappointed, sitting on a sort of doggy bed while Greytail <laughs> ties his leash to a ring embedded in the stone wall. Then Greytail leaves the room. Sonic waits a moment. Sit on the floor, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Sit on the floor! Sonic waits a moment, then scoffs and unties his leash from the ring on the wall. Then he tries and fails to detach it from his collar. Now I know why Amy always needs help with her necklaces. Yeah. Sonic tries to take off the collar, but only manages to strangle himself by pulling on it. Oh, to hell with it! The door opens and Sonic turns to see Shadow walk in. You know, it's not very nice... <laughs> Um, you know, yeah. it's not very nice to send your friend off with a mean cat to be tied up somewhere. What gives? It seems smarter than wandering around trying to find this room ourselves. Oh. Now, do you know what happened with that chaos control? Eh, not exactly. I mean, usually I can tell the distance of a teleport by how much effort it takes, but that felt like I was trying to... I was trying to jump to the other side of the galaxy. Were you trying to jump to the other side of the galaxy? No. Were you? I was trying to go to the Ark, where I wouldn't be bothered. Ah, right. I guess trying to warp to two different places at once with the same remold is a really bad idea. Obviously. A few moments pass in awkward silence. Um, can you take me off this leash? I don't think I should, actually. What? Listen, if you think I'm going to be some slave for even another minute, you've... Shh! They'll hear you outside. I think we're in some other backwards reality. Everyone keeps staring at my skates, but Black Doom didn't try to kill us. So this must be a completely different world. And this one comes with new rules. New rules? Like what? Like you being quiet and giving me some time to think, Faker. You're supposed to be a slave, obviously. Yeah, your slave, if we want to be exact. And that's not gonna happen. Now take me off this leash. Fine. Then what? Well, we'll kick Black Doom's butt and escape? Escape where, Sonic? This was a dimensional jump via chaos control. We just pushed, and I... Oh, push, pull, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> oh, push, pull, am we I right? <laughs> we just pushed this. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Get in there. All right. Chaos push. Escape where, Sonic? <laughs> chaos, chaos come. come. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Again, the same idea. <laughs> Escape where, Sonic? This was a dimensional jump via chaos control we just pulled, and I don't think you can get home by just running really fast. Okay, fine. You tell me what we're supposed to do now, Mr. Ultimate Lifeform, because I don't want to stay here. Do now. Shut up. Came here with a chaos. <laughs> <laughs> what were we supposed to do now? Be quiet. <laughs> Put more energy in it, man. You're 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 being very monotone. Dumao. Sorry. Especially when when he, when he's like ex <laughs> doing exclamations. Like, come on. What? Put like, more energy what? in it. Nah. Yeah. Eh. <laughs> Anyways. Nah. Yeah. Be yeah. whinier. If we came here with a chaos emerald, we need one to leave again. Do you still have it with you? Well, do you, punk? Um, no. It kinda dropped. Huh. Fine. So we'll have to go looking for it. Perhaps in the dungeon where we arrived. Uh, yeah. The dungeon. 
I say we go there right now. You come and sh- Sonic is interrupted by a knock on the door. My prince, I have come for the discipline <laughs> measures for the slave. Sonic growls and moves toward the door again, but Shadow grabs his collar and opens the door. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> 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 oh my god. But Shadow grabs his collar and opens the door instead. Sonic struggles to breathe. What measures were you thinking of? I almost said laser. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> what measures were you thinking of, Lazar? Just the standard whipping, my prince. However... Salt in the wounds should prolong the pain to deprive him of sleep, which we haven't tried yet. It could be the key to finally break him. Yes, good idea. Give me the necessary utensils. Sonic is horrified. Well? But, but my prince, surely you would like assistance? I think I can handle Sonic by myself. Crop and salt, please. Okay, Let me you... try that again. Okay, Let me sure. try that again. I thought you did that was good. that was really bad. Would you like a cough drop, my prince? <laughs> no, I need water. Hang on. <laughs> Force a fried chicken drink some water intensely. <laughs> Better. (laughs) (laughs) I think I can handle Sonic by myself. Crop and salt, please. Lazar gives him the items reluctantly, looking disappointed. You have been most helpful. That will be all for today. Shadow closes the door with his foot and puts the salt (laughs) on the table. Right. Come here. Sonic backs away, holding his hands up defensively. Whoa. Whoa there, Shads. If you think for one second that I'm going to let you lash me. Shadow whips a cushion, making a loud smack sound. Sonic is very confused. Shadow hits it harder and then rolls his eyes. Now scream already. Shadow whips the cushion again, and Sonic yelps. They continue (laughs) the charade for a bit, and Sonic (laughs) looks amused. Fuck. (laughs) <laughs> and Sonic looks both amused and embarrassed. The cushion begins spewing feathers with each hit, and Sonic has a difficult time sounding like he's in agony as he tries not to laugh at the situation. A few minutes later... A few minutes Shadow later... Shadow continue... Oh, you're, you're, be- you're better at that than I am, damn. Um, yeah, yeah, I, I, I want to be all read those it, it says a few minutes later. A few okay, okay later. sure, 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 sure. But yeah, Uh, keep going. Shadow continues whipping the cushion with Sonic screaming loudly each time, while Sonic ruffles his fur and uses the wash basin to add some tear streaks. Then he lays down on the slave bed and Shadow sprays salt around him. Shadow opens the door again. Lazar, are you still there? Certainly, my prince. As he melts in from the shadows, Lazar glances through the door at Sonic as he receives the crop and salt from Shadow. Sonic looks like a trembling picture of misery. Lazar gives a pleased... (laughs) Lazar gives a pleased nod and leaves. Shadow closes the door. That was close. Eh, We could have just knocked him unconscious for eavesdropping. These people here are their creeps. Utter. The big utters. These people here are utter. (laughs) (laughs) Sorry. Utter creeps. They're all cows. These people here are utter creeps. I don't want to know what getting sold on your flayed back for real would feel like. Ugh, man. Being a slave sucks. Which reminds me. So, for the third time, take me off this leash. Shadows. Uh, uh, Do it it more like whiny. Like, take me off this leash! Okay. So, for the third time, take me off this leash! Shadow scowls for a moment, but then moves over to oblige. Fine, I will. But we still need to stay in our roles, so your collar stays on. 
I don't think Black Doom would take kindly to our situation if he found out that I'm not his son, but a traveler from another dimension who probably killed his otherworldly self off. Until we find that emerald, I suggest we act like we belong here. As Shadow fumbles with Sonic's collar, Sonic tenses up and blushes slightly, his expression uncomfortable and confused. Man, the sexual tension here is insane. I mean, <clears throat> ticklish <laughs> figure. Ah, uh, well, mm. no, not really. I suggest we wait until morning to search for the emerald. It would look suspicious if you... <laughs> Fuck. It would look <laughs> suspicious if you were out and about for the next few hours, wounded as you're supposed to be. Sonic yawns and moves towards the bed. Sure. I call bed, by the way. Can you do a yawn? Oh, yeah. Ah, sure. I call bed, by the way. What was that? <laughs> that, that wasn't a yawn. Ah. That was... Ah. Yeah. Do an actual yawn. Ah. Uh, <laughs> ah. <laughs> no, ah. no, no, man. No, man. Do, uh, come on. It's more like... Ah. Uh, I don't know how to yawn. How do you not know how to yawn? I mean, uh, I guess. Sure, I call bed, by the way. There you go. Sonic flings himself onto the bed on his back, hands laced behind his head, eyes closed. Shadow stands in front of the bed, glaring at him. You know, since I am the prince, this is my bed. First come, first served. You've been too slow, as usual. You're going to be the first one to come. Um, anyways. <laughs> <laughs> I could just leash you again and tie you to that ring. Oh, wait, I'm reading. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and then I would strangle you with that very same item in your sleep. Forget it. And don't even think of starting a fight, because we'd get half the castle to come running, and probably reduce the bed and the rest of the furniture to splinters in the process. Shadow only continues glaring. Sonic uncrosses his legs and unzips his pants. (laughs) (laughs) Sound a bit... sound smug when you say this. Yep. And after all, I am a bed slave. Sonic... There's an emphasis on the am. Okay. Like... And after all, I am a bed slave. Sonic chuckles as Sonic legs... What the fuck? Okay. Sonic chuckles (laughs) as Sonic's legs part. Shadow abruptly turns around, looking very flustered. Yeah, I'm flustered! (laughs) Out. Now. Sonic snorts and gets under the sheets, getting comfortable. Um, I'm gonna blow up the candle now, just so you know. I can see in near darkness. Ugh, okay, whatever. We'll share, but I'm not that cruel, you know? Faker, Robotnik will become a fitness trainer. Meh. Fuck. <laughs> Faker, Robotnik will become a fitness trainer. Before Robotnik? I sl- Robotnik. Shut your bitch ass <laughs> up! <laughs> Robotnik. <laughs> Robotnik will become a fitness trainer before I consent to sleep in the same bed as you. Mm. Suit yourself, Shads, but don't come crying to me when you wake up sore. I've had my share of nights spent on a cold stone in Eggman's various dungeons, and those aren't the sort of memories I treasure. You want to feel sore? (laughs) (laughs) He's got a... Shake this dick! (laughs) Eggman's got a machine for that. Anyway... Um, (laughs) Sonic blows out the light and settles into sleep. Shadow stays standing for a bit. A chilly breeze blows through. God fucking damn it. Uh, Eventually, Shadow approaches the bedside. Okay, fine. You win. Now roll the hell over. Sonic smirks as he rolls over and Shadow climbs into bed. His dick slowly gets hard. (laughs) <laughs> yeah <laughs> okay that's enough for today but thanks yeah I promise there will be more and if you don't want to miss it you can always subscribe yeah <laughs>